So Scott, this golden moment is extra special. I actually actually saw this one on Facebook yep. earlier this week, and it's just so inspirational. Now, warning, this is probably going to bring a tear to your eye. There's a professor at Arkansas State University in Jonesboro, Emily Eubanks. Cisco uh, challenged her students to create a piece of equipment for her dad. This is her dad in this picture. Her occupational therapy students created this piece of equipment, the hugger, to help him hug his loved mm -hmm. ones. And this is his response. What do you have to tell the students? Oh, I appreciate everything y'all have done. This is a dream of mine. You want to give Rick a hug? I sure do. <laughs> Come here, young man. <laughs> uh. Aww. Mm. Mm. Oh, that is so great. So she challenged her students there in her class to come up with something. You know, she she actually showed them a video beforehand of her dad so that they could see, you know, that there there were so many things that were difficult for him sure. to do. And so they all brainstormed and, and, you know, she mentioned that he's not able to hug people because of this disability. And so she could see he was just in tears because he was able to hug his grandsons yeah, there. Raw emotion. You can tell that that is certainly going to impact his future, his grandkids future. Yeah, he'll be forever grateful and the future too. Uh, it's a big, you know, very impactful for those students to see that they came up with something that actually made a huge difference to right. someone. And, and hopefully they continue thinking in terms of, okay, yeah. I'm about to enter into this professional field. How can I make a difference in someone else's life? I've done it once. Let's do it again. Right. And that just gave me chills too. For one, I'm an Arkansas State grad, so I, I love that. But it, just to find it so organically, just that people were sharing it on social media. Right. A lot of times we'll hear about these stories, you know, because they're passed along and we're like, oh, this is a great story out of sure. somewhere. And this one is from right here in Arkansas, which love just that. makes it even better.